Hello everyone, and today we're going to be taking a look at Huge Bag. Huge Bag is a plugin that is a bagpack replacement. And you're going to go ahead and load it either through the new plugin manager or through slash plugins load huge bag. Now, as you can see, there are several options. This is how it comes pre configured. Up top, it's got the free used max amount. Your bag has uh, totally been replaced. Uh, the I will, the I key will close and open it back up. You have some interesting options though that you do not have in your default bags if you're wondering why would I use this. Okay, for example, sort. You can sort all your items. As you can see, there, you have an option to merge if you have several items that can be merged into one stack. Sort will also merge them together as well. You can search. And as you can see, as you type out, see, we'll do thistle. And as you can see, the only thing that's left is the distilled milk, milk thistle drops. If you want to dismiss that, you can just click anywhere in the back area. So some really cool options there that I really like. I mean, the fact that it keeps my bag organized is a huge plus to me. However, if there's options that you want, there are plenty to be had. A lot of them are cosmetic. As you can see, there is a, you can, tar you can toggle the startup visibility of each bag, whether it starts up or down or hidden or there. Whether or not the escape key will allow you to close it, I personally keep that available because when I press escape, I want nothing on the screen. For top bar options, you can hide the huge bag title. You can slow uh, all the slot information where it says free used max. That can all go away. You can have it show nothing or you can have them show both. Bottom bar options, you can take away those buttons if you don't want them. There, that's why they disappeared the first time around. And you can also change the background color if you want. See? Change the slots to be anything you want. I think I'll choose white for right now. Yeah, with the pink. Well, I'll just click on back and choose save. Alright, you go back up here, right click, and you bring up back up the options. You can go ahead and change the widget location. Uh, you can also do that by sliding it up and down, kind of dragging it back and forth, or right click and click whether or not you want on the right side or the left side. If you want a list of all the shell commands, different things you can do by sla typing slash huge bag, you can click right there. It brings you up a nice little list. Show, hide, unload, reload, reset all, and so forth. You can see most of those are the same options that you'll get by this command right here, right, this command menu right here. However, it's just all depends on how you like to do things. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and reset all settings to default. And as you can see, it goes ahead and puts it back there. I went ahead and slide it up by, instead of by left clicking on the menu at the lower bottom left hand corner. You can click right there. You can use the I key again to bring it back out. I'm gonna right click here. And here's a nice little interesting sorting thing where you can have it show, ah, I don't remember where all my potions are, and sort's not quite doing it for me. I just click right there and show potions. Ooh. Want to get rid of that? I can go ahead and sh show all, but the same thing, you know, show all armor. You can see all my armor, where it is. Show my recipes, I don't have any. Show ingredients, you can see. Show buffs. Okay. It's just a really nice, really just customizable, made so you can find things in your backpack. And if you're like me, I have a hard time finding things in your backpack. What if this interface doesn't quite suit you? Well, well there's another form of the interface that you can use. You go ahead and click on toggle from widget and window mode, or you can type slash huge bags space mode. I'll go ahead and do that. And I'm going to go ahead and type huge bags or slash huge bags reload. And 
And as you can see, this is the window form. Window can go anywhere. The other one is tied to the side. And this is more of a familiar uh, UI interface for you. It does all the same things. As you can see, you've got the sort, the search, and the merge. And you can right click again when you get to the different corners to bring up the different command interfaces. And of course, you can use the X to close. So that is huge bag. And honestly, I like it a lot. It has, it is one of the plugins that I have set to load for all my characters. I myself, I prefer widget mode. So go ahead and if I wanted to switch back, I'd do slash huge bag mode and then slash huge bag reload and I'm back to widget mode. So that's huge bag for you. I would go ahead and give it a try. You can download it from Lotro interface. And that's all we have for this version of Lotro Plugins Review.